Hello and welcome everybody. J-Man back for another day's worth of reactions. It's my Saturday. I hope you're all doing well out there, staying safe, staying connected. Uh, Going to be starting out with our throwback of the day as per usual and then moving into a few different kinds of requests. Uh, remember, if you do have a song you'd like me to react to, you need to find my video titled Your Suggestions Here. Link to that video is down in the description below. You need to put your request as a comment in that video not in a reaction video like this one that won't make my list uh you can also connect with me in other ways you can see over to my side and if you do enjoy the music we're reacting to on my channel please do what you can to support the artist links to the original videos are down in the description below so uh i believe my headset may have just turned itself off bear with me here there we go all right um so all of that stuff out of the way uh, this was the, this, uh, request for a, uh, throwback came from my bin, which you can actually find over on my discord. Uh, there is a channel for, uh, throwback suggestions. You're welcome to go over there and throw a suggestion in there. Just be sure to my, be mindful of the rules, what qualifies as a throwback. Um, it has to be something that was widely popular that I knew um that were basically kind of revisiting sort of a thing uh so i decided to go with rat lay it down uh this particular album invasion of your privacy was one that i'm pretty sure i played through uh like at least two cassettes wore out at, at least two cassettes um and would buy the album, uh, buy the cassette again, because I would just play the snot out of it um, and uh, end up wearing through the tape and the tape would break or something like that. But I was huge. Just the bottom line, I was huge into Rat. Um, loved them back in the day. Saw them in concert at least once, maybe twice. I think twice. Um, but uh, yeah, this is, this is a classic. One of my favorites by them. Uh, here we go. Let's dive on in. Rat, lay it down. Let's get it. That's a unique vocal. The picture does kind of scream 80s, doesn't it, Eric? The cut-off t-shirt. Um, I don't think I ever noticed what the what the heck's going on outside the window there. Could be, 
I guess. Looks more like an apparition or something. <laughs> Just in, don't say it. <laughs> All right. Oop. Yeah, so that was, uh, again, like I said, just one of my favorites, You're in Love, another classic from the album. Um, but, uh, yeah, to me, I just really like the, yeah, the, the classic 80s fade out um, for sure. But, um, yeah, it just so reminds me of my um, misspent youth uh, as a teenager back in high school. Um, cruising around in the car with all that great 80s hair metal blasting, uh, hanging out at the arcade with my friends, uh, doing all the things we did, going to parties on weekends. Um, you know, I, I, I had quite the profitable little business, uh, when I was, uh, in high school. Uh, you know, there were plenty of, of high schoolers that either their parents couldn't afford a car for, for their teenage kids or um, they just didn't trust them with one. Um, every Saturday and uh, Friday and Saturday night, uh, we would all go out to the to the arcade, hang out around the arcade until somebody would put together a party somewhere. Um, there were a number of different places around town, um, outdoor locations that we would usually set up a kegger, uh, places that were out on the Indian reservation mostly, uh, so that we wouldn't get busted by the cops for the most part. Um, but uh, so I, I had basically my own little taxi service, taxiing people up to the parties because uh, the parties were usually, you know, a few miles, to, you know, five, ten miles away from the arcade. And uh, so I would come hang out at the arcade and then um, basically collect uh, two or three dollars a piece um, from people to give them a ride up to um, up to the party. Um, usually a bud would suffice, you know, nice little chunk of weed would do as well. So by the end of a Friday or Saturday night, I would, uh, usually have made at least 15, 20, 30 bucks or so, um, from playing taxi man plus, you know, a little stash for myself. Um, so yeah, just kind of reminds me of that driving out to driving people, shuttling people out to, um, to the, the kegger of the weekend of the night, um, listening to some rock music, uh, blasting, jamming out. Um, but anyways, I hope you enjoyed that YouTube. Let me know what you thought down in the comments below. Uh, we'll be back for a few more here to finish out the day. Hope to see you for that. Peace. <laughs>